The Presidential Amnesty Program has launched 1.5 billion Naira cooperative fund to empower ex-agitators of the Niger Delta region. At the official launch of the scheme in Abuja, the interim administrator of the program, retired Major General Barry Nduomo, explained that the initiative is a novel economic development scheme designed to create more valuable means of livelihood for ex-agitators. Correspondent Happy Dalawal reports. From the onset of the discovery of oil in Oloibiri in 1956 till date, the Niger Delta region has suffered from environmental degradation and neglect from multinational oil companies. The region is supposed to be a model region in Nigeria in terms of socio-economic development, industries, youth empowerment and employment, but the reverse is the case. In their quest to bite a slice of the national cake, they took self-help by bombing, kidnapping and abducting expatriate in exchange for ransom. Different militants and pressure groups emerged. The amnesty program was unveiled on 15 June 2009, aimed at bringing relative peace and provide reorientation of the youth. Over the years, the reintegration program has not delivered necessary results. Hence, the need for this cooperative scheme to ensure the business-oriented ones have access to funds. A lot of difficulties here and there. These are problems, and we have to solve the problems. Any person, any person who wants to be a leader, who wants to be a leader, must be prepared to serve. And you serve by uh, attending to problems. There is no society without problems, and we must be able to attend the, the problems faced by people in this, particularly the helpless people. The whole idea is to discourage the stipend, reliance on stipends, which you will all agree with me. It's practically introduced the culture of dependency, indolence, and um, which is not in our best interest. And so we have decided that rather than give them the fish, it is better to teach them how to fish. Departing from the way it used to run, this cooperative scheme will now provide a sufficient and hands-on component for the ex-agitators. Beyond militancy, this move is to ensure that there is a lasting socio-economic dependence in the region. Habida Lawal, TVC News, Abuja.